the Farmer Veteran Coalition, Avoiding Homelessness, and Network Theory. I'm Army veteran Earl Scott, and that's all coming up next on VA News. Veterans have an opportunity to use the land they fought to defend, getting assistance along the way. The Farmer Veteran Coalition is the nation's largest nonprofit organization, assisting veterans to embark on careers in agriculture. Veterans can use FVC grants to get started and get connected with other veteran farmers to gain experience, advice, and find camaraderie. The program is a 17-week comprehensive hands-on model, including training in the production, management, and marketing of small-scale food production. Veterans receive a specialized technical certificate of credit. To learn more, visit farmvetco.org. Temporary bans on evictions implemented during the pandemic have expired. There are many ways veterans can access VA's homeless prevention and rapid rehousing services. Veterans can remain in stable housing through VA's Supportive Services for Veterans Families program, with services ranging from temporary financial assistance and legal aid to childcare subsidies. The program's intervention initiative provides a modest subsidy for two years. Visit va.gov slash housing resources for information on resources for veterans who may be at risk of losing their home. Veterans who are homeless or at imminent risk of homelessness are strongly encouraged to visit their local VA medical center, where VA staff are standing by to assist. Or contact the National Call Center for Homeless Veterans at 877-424-3838, where trained counselors are available 24-7. Predicting suicide has long been one of the most researched subjects in psychology. An emerging approach in mental health research called network theory illustrates how a series of variables, in this case risk factors for suicide, relate to each other and which ones are most important, thus addressing a major shortcoming of other methodologies. These results offer valuable information for both predicting suicide risk and differentiating targets for interventions lowering the risk of suicide. To learn more about this topic, visit blogs.va.gov and search network theory. That's it for this episode of VA News. I'm Earl Scott. Thanks for watching.